disassembly and rebuild of the models 45 and 45R. Place the nailer in a padded vise. Using pliers, straighten the cotter pin on the tapered side of the number 5 roller pin. Remove the cotter pin by tapping it out. Save the cotter pin for reinstallation. Tap and drive out the number 5 roller pin. Remove the plunger head, plunger spring, and plunger spring pin by lifting straight out of the nailer body. Slide off the rubber blade retainer, drive blade, and plunger spring. To install a new drive blade, look for the milled T-slot on the plunger head. Driving blade is stamped front. Insert the new driving blade with the stamped face upward. Locate the label on the rubber blade retainer. Writing will be facing down towards the nailer body. Slide the rubber blade retainer over the new drive blade. Push it flush to the underside of the plunger head. Add the plunger spring and plunger spring pin to the plunger. Line up the slot on the spring pin with the drive blade which will face the front of the nailer. Slide all components into the top of the nailer body. Slide the number 5 roller pin into the nailer while holding the plunger down. Slide the cotter pin through the tapered end of the number 5 roller pin. Wrap the cotter pin legs to secure it in place.